I practice the field of orthopedics, so that's conditions of bones, joints, muscles, uh, and the connective tissue, ligaments and tendons. We provide a team-based approach to our care. So I'm in close contact with our surgeon, Dr. McElleru. He's always available for any questions or situations, and I think that's important for patients to know that you know it's not just one person they're seeing, it really is a team-based approach. What I like about providing care in the North Country is we see a, a wide range of people and conditions in our office, and it's very satisfying to get people back to their you know, optimal functioning, their optimal state. I do a lot of injections, mostly of the knees and shoulders. So we do a lot of steroid injections to help try to calm down uh, some pain and also for diagnosing issues of the knees and the shoulders and the hips. Typically, a first visit, we get a detailed history. We need to know how long the problem's been going on, what caused the problem, what makes the problem worse, what makes it better. This really helps us narrow down the potential causes of the problem and also gives us a good idea of what we can do about it. Another important factor is how aggressive we want to be in treating something. And by this, I mean, what are the patient's goals of treatment? So a young athlete, we would treat differently than a retired grandparent, because uh, they would each have different goals. How often we see a patient really depends on what their problem is. If it's an acute injury, something that's just recently happened, say a, a broken bone, we may bring them back once a week for x-rays, especially if we're treating it in a cast and we want to make sure that the reduction has been preserved, uh, the bones haven't moved. So someone like that we would see fairly often, maybe once a week. In someone who has arthritis, we may only see them once or twice a year. My philosophy of care is to really listen to the patient's story, to figure out what they want and what they expect. And then I combine that with what I find in my physical exams to discuss realistic options for them and to come up with an appropriate plan of care for that specific patient.